the green plants class 4 science before starting today's lesson let us do an activity let's join the dots and get the leaves Well, it turned good. Now, answer some questions. Do all the leaves have the same size? No. Do all the leaves have a smooth edge? No. Do all the leaves have a pointed tip? No. If you look around, you will find different plants, having different types of leaves. Let us learn more about the leaf of a plant. By the end of this chapter, you will understand about Leaf How do leaves make food? And The interdependence of plants and animals Leaf Most of the plants on earth are green plants. They appear green due to the presence of the green substance, called, chlorophyll, present in their leaves. There are different types of leaves. Plants can be identified by looking at their leaves. Have a look at the leaves of five different trees. Parts of a leaf A leaf has a flat part called, the leaf blade. Some leaves have a very broad leaf blade, whereas some have narrow ones. Each leaf usually has one main vein, and many side veins. Veins help in the transportation of substances, example, water, minerals, and prepared food, to and from the leaf. The underside of a leaf contains millions of tiny openings. These tiny openings are called stomata. The stomata let air flow in and out of the leaf. Functions of a leaf A leaf performs some functions, they are The leaf of a plant makes food. Therefore, it is called the food factory of a plant. It helps a plant to let air in and out through stomata. How do leaves make food? Green plants make their own food, with the help of chlorophyll, present in their leaves. They use light, water, and carbon dioxide, present in the air as raw materials, to make their food. These raw materials are obtained through the process. The process is Water is absorbed by the roots and carried through the stem to the leaves. When light falls on the leaves, it is absorbed by chlorophyll. Carbon dioxide is taken in through stomata. After the food is prepared, oxygen is given out through the stomata. The stomata perform some very important functions for the plant, are They take in and give out air. They remove water vapor and oxygen after photosynthesis from the plant. The process by which leaves use sunlight to convert water and carbon dioxide into food is called photosynthesis. Use and storage of food by plants The food prepared by the process of photosynthesis is called glucose. The stem and branches of the plant take the prepared food from the leaves to other parts of the plant. The plant uses some of this food for its daily activities, and stores the extra food, as starch in its different parts. Know your scientist Janakya Mal was an Indian woman botanist. Botanist means a person who studies plants, who studied different types of sugar canes, 
and brinjals. Her research is responsible for significantly increasing the sweetness of Indian sugar canes. She also studied various medicinal and valuable plants found in the rainforests of Kerala. The Interdependence of Plants and Animals Plants and animals are dependent on each other in many ways. Green plants are the main producers of food. Animals depend on these plants for their food. Thus, a chain exists in nature for obtaining food. A chain that shows a series of organisms where each member depends on the lower member, in the series for food is called a food chain. This interdependence of plants and animals in a food chain helps to maintain a balance between the numbers of plants and animals. Thus, if there is a sudden increase or decrease in the number of either plants or animals the balance in nature will be disturbed. Besides, plants also give out oxygen, which is needed by animals to breathe. Animals in return give out carbon dioxide, which is needed by plants for photosynthesis. Recap A leaf has a leaf blade, the main vein, and side veins. Plants breathe through tiny openings called stomata, found on the underside of the leaves. A leaf is called the food factory of a plant. Green plants make their own food by the process of photosynthesis. Plants and animals are interdependent. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.